State officials say that we're seeing an increase in the amount of kids who have coronavirus and parents need to pay attention because their symptoms are likely going to be a lot different than what adults are experiencing. In children, Pay particular attention to abdominal symptoms or nausea or vomiting. New Mexico now with the second highest rate of coronavirus infections amongst children in the country. We're at 13 percent. The U.S. average is 3.2 percent. So the infection rate in children in New Mexico is four times higher. But why are we seeing an increase in children's cases now? It could be multifactorial. Uh, it could be on one hand that we are paying more attention to kids now. So when this virus first came out, it clearly and still is affecting older adults in a much more severe way than children. University of New Mexico doctor Walter DeHorty saying it could also be because the virus is changing. It could be mutating or altering somewhat. Kids might also just be asymptomatic to the virus or our state's lack of resources may also be a factor, such as what we're seeing out on the Navajo Nation. Children could obviously be caught up in that and affected and because we're investigating that very thoroughly, we're uncovering these pockets of pediatric infection that may not be present in other states. And for parents, doctors say keep a close eye on your kids because symptoms can be hard to spot. Children could present with a more typical respiratory type infection. They might have a rash. They might be sleepy. They might have some of that abdominal pain. For more information on COVID-19 symptoms in kids, you could visit our website at KOAT.com. Reporting in Albuquerque, Maris Armas, KOAT Action 7 News. Doctors say anyone can die, obviously, from COVID-19, and it's important to keep in mind they are learning more about the virus every single day.